Okay. Couple more minutes. Now look at this nice. Well, this is a good time to start putting your buns on. And you want you want a kind of bun that hold well to a hamburger's weight, right? So these are two thick buns. We have a half a bun for our bun. Okay. So now it's time to flip. Remember, I did not push on the hamburger in no time or just moved it once, right? So if you can flip it this easy, this is the time to turn it, right? Right? Just like that. There we go. So what you want, you see how this is a very um, seared meat. You don't, you shouldn't get any flare-ups that much. If you get flare-ups, you want to move your burgers away from the flare-ups until they sort of die down. But you're going to get some flare-ups right now. Okay, so the important thing is to not um, press on these meats, right? So what you want is this bouncy quality. Let me see if I can get that for you. You want to be able to bounce it off, right? Let's see. Let's see that. You want the meat to be bouncy, right? So this is not cooked. It's really soft right now. You need to give it a few more minutes, huh? Two, three minutes on this side.